Keeping you safe at the pump, Atlanta's elected leaders trying to boost security at gas stations. They want cameras at every single one of those businesses, but they need help from the state to make it happen. The last several months have seen recurring attacks like these at gas stations all across the metro. The crimes ranging from shootings to robberies, even carjackings. And according to the FBI, it's among the most common location for a violent crime. There were a whopping 32,000 such incidents in 2020. CBS 46's Adam Murphy live at the BP on Memorial Drive in Atlanta with more on this story. Adam. Well, good evening. So here's the deal. A lot of gas stations like this BP here in the city already have security cameras, but the problem is they don't always work. And now city leaders would like to change that to help them fight crime. High prices at the pump is one concern. The other is becoming a growing trend here in Metro Atlanta. I see it everywhere I go. Crime scenes like this have become all too familiar at local gas stations. I no longer pump fuel in the evening simply because I don't feel safe. It's one reason Atlanta Council Member Keisha Waits would like to mandate that every gas station and convenience store in the city install working security cameras. We're asking that they invest in commercial grade cameras and maintain its footage for a 90 day period of time. That way, individuals who are investigating these different homicides or issues that we're having, they will have access to footage. City leaders believe the high tech cameras will deter crime and assist investigators while the Atlanta Police Department is dealing with a shortage of officers. But it's not that easy. We have to have approval from the state government because the state law prohibits us from passing or imposing a tax to a business owner unless it's surrounding the issue of, of, of assisting law enforcement individ individuals or a public safety too. Garnering state support for such a mandate may be challenging. State Representative Jay Collins chairs the Public Safety Committee and said he has concerns about requiring businesses to cover the cost and would rather invest in law enforcement. And it is our belief that this is a small price to pay to ensure public good. And back here at the BP on Memorial Drive in Atlanta, I asked the manager if he'd be willing to cover the cost to upgrade his security cameras. He said, quote, it's a real good idea and he's willing to pay the price no matter what it is. We're live at this BP here in Atlanta, Adam Murphy, CBS 46.